Hi, this is David from Smart Wall. We're gonna uh, install or plug and play actually the uh, up to car 11 in a Hyundai Ionic. This is a hybrid EV um, vehicle, so uh, which is very simple to use. We're just gonna plug and play the product in the USB port here on the car and just wait a few seconds until the product is recognized on the screen and start playing with it uh, it's a great solution as you can see it's already it's gonna put the volume down on the on the car radio it was too high the the solution will bring you um, the capability to install multiple apps into your um, car radio through the device through the USB so it takes uh, seconds to load and once loading you can do amazing things with it uh, you can you you can watch Netflix, watch uh, uh, stream apps like YouTube or Disney Plus, uh, <clears throat> Binge, any other app that you may use. I'll just say um, just for your safety, do not operate this while driving. Okay, <coughs> I'm sorry. And here we go. So the first thing we do is we go to settings, and then on settings we make sure that device is connected via Wi-Fi with our hotspot on our mobile phone. It should uh, detect our mobile phone and pair it with it. Ready? Now it has been paired and now we just can go to the main screen. Here we go. And from here we just simply launch Netflix. So we're going to test Netflix first because I think it's one of those apps that most of the people wants to use and have available on the car. And I'm just going to put this on, on an angle that looks great I'm just in a brilliant bright day here and uh, the speed of Netflix of course depends on the speed of your internet access on your mobile phone so uh, let's see how it goes in this area hopefully I have a good internet access here just uh, this is uh, using my Netflix account of course at the beginning you have to to put your credentials to log in and once you log in uh, it's all good um, so um, is a great solution so you can use it to watch Netflix uh, to install apps like um, extra maps that you may use also you can use to um, to install uh, Net Facebook uh, well different things here we go it's Netflix now up and running and from here just very simple we just select the 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 the, um, the movie we want to watch and just click play and the system is going to start loading the the movie and start presenting into your car radio there we go and the volume of course you can use this to ramp up the volume and the sound comes from the car uh, speakers So great solution. We have Netflix now on our car radio with up to car. We're just gonna skip this. With uh, with this area here, you can go to the main menu. Just click on this button here, and it goes to the main menu. And just close this one down. There we go. Uh, apart from Netflix, of course, we have all the things. We have wireless CarPlay on this. So if you want to use wireless CarPlay, you can use it. We have wireless Android Auto. We have mirroring, so you can mirror your mobile phone uh, uh, and also cast for cast from, for example, YouTube or some apps that have casting capabilities. You can cast to the screen. Um, so uh, I have installed a few apps here. We have Maps, Netflix, YouTube. Uh, we have um, off-road um, navigation uh, maps. Like we, you can install Hema, of of, of course. Um, uh, for those who likes the off-roading uh, or camping and also for cars like this you can uh, well this doesn't need to be charged of course but for those cars who are pure electric vehicles you can install apps like open charge char maps to find your closest um, um, charging station uh, also we have torque here OBD2 is for uh, people who wants to have ODB2 um, um, adapters installed in the car and they can connect with the 
MMB via Bluetooth. So yeah, it's a full on solution. You can have a lot of things play with it a lot uh, and have all the applications available for here uh, from your car here. And uh, if please, if you want to find more about the MMB uh, up to car, just go to www.smartworldcompany.com.